Welcome back, everybody. Drone 608 plays. Playing Pathfinder Kingmaker, the down, barn holds lot download uh, content. Uh, this is supposed to affect what I do in my main campaign. Um, inventory wise, I'm at medium. So I'm not going to gather this stuff yet. There was something over here. So there's some stuff over here that I want to clear up. And then I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to grab a bunch of this stuff and then uh, right before the break and then I'm going to upload everybody, uh, upgrade everybody a level here. So we're going to wander over here, grab this, which is stuff. Walk down here just in case there's something hidden. There isn't. Okay, so we're going to grab all of this stuff. And moving it heavy. Oh, what's that? All right, we're going to go loot and raise levels, so this is not going to be a very interesting session here. Um, can I get... Oh, I'm in, over-encumbered at this point. <clears throat> oh, I hate being over-encumbered. All right, so... Have to drop at least something. I have to drop a lot. Why am I so low? Oh. Means of protection plus one don't really get me anywhere. So I had to drop a little bit there, but what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead, we're going to go into uh, up, upping our characters here a level. So uh, if you don't want to see this stuff, you know, go on to the next video. The, uh, if you like what you see, hit the thumbs up button. If you really like what you see, go ahead and subscribe and hit the notify button. You'll be notified when I upload videos. Uh, basically, I just get a combat feed out of this. I get an ability score. <sighs> I really don't know what to take. Um, nothing I take is going to really matter. Because they're all evens here. I don't think I'm going to make it to like 12th level where I get another one. So, uh, In case I get a potion or something. It, uh... Yeah, hit points matter, I guess. Um, I get two points. I'm going to definitely keep my perception up high. Um, athletics don't really matter. This was a mistake on my part as a fighter. I shouldn't have specialized in athletics. Those five points could have been used um, for magic device and stuff. So, I'll just splash one there. No, oh, that doesn't really help. Does it? Oh, boy. Uh, 
I'll up my use magic device. Um, I get a combat feat. This would give me an extra plus one to attack. This would make me go quicker. Um, I have not have been having people take uh, the these things, which are teamwork feats, because I really don't have two fighter types to use them with. Whereas in the main campaign, you saw me do that with... I have four choices of four melee fighters, so I had them all taking different uh, things like that. Um, the only thing I can think of is I just want to be able to hit really good. This helps... The threat range is doubled for that, but I think I just want to be able to make sure that I hit. Because monsters are going to get tougher and tougher. So I'm going to like be really good with the Master Sword. And that's all I get for him. Um, I am up to 92 hit points. I My Cleric... Uh, we're going to go up. Now we've picked up this, the Nimbus of Light, and an Aura of Heroism, so I can do some things like that. Get an ability score plus here. It doesn't. There isn't a lot I got going for me here. Um, so I guess I'll go with my primary stat. Um, with only three points. I'm going to splash in here so I have a chance to use those things. It's not real good with these magic device, but... So I got up to 4th level spells. Uh, Never hesitate. He's kind of straightforward as well. We're just roguing him up. Because um, he picks up a rogue talent and improved uncanny dodge. Doesn't get a lot uh, a point here. I figured I wanted to do this just because it would take the minus off my will save. So I'm a plus five. I do have seven points here. Um, trickery is always a good one. I'm not worried about stealth. I shouldn't have been working on stealth anyway because I never stealth myself. Um, definitely on perception. I don't know if I'm going to need persuasion. Uh, I might need a mobility check yet. Got three left. So I thought I was going to just give him a chance at these and up his knowledge world. And then we're done with that. I get a I get a rogue talent here. I can go for this to get really good perception. Um, I could skill focus on something. Train mastery. Okay. Damage right here. Can you make attacks and train one round? That doesn't seem like it's going to help much. Uh, focusing attack. These get you out of conditions if you hit with sneak attack damage, which is hard. I don't do stealth. So I was thinking I'd check on combat trick, and this is, uh, I get an extra attack with my offhand weapon, so that just seems like a good thing to do since he's always fighting with two short swords. So we'll do that. And then he's complete, 67 hit points. This is... Porthos, who's my bard. up a thing points wise it's like you know what do you what do you pick here because they're all evens and it's not really going to matter much um, the 
this helps with mobility and trickery. Intelligence would help those two. Wisdom. I'm going to definitely splash a point in the wisdom thing, so I'm at least plus eight there. Um, I'm probably going to put the rest in perception because I think I really need to get my perception up. Maybe one in trickery. Okay, so if I put one in trickery and I put one so at least have a chance there up his perception and his persuasion I guess for now and the one point over here I really can't figure out what to do um, because it's just going to make it be an odd number, so I'm going to go for hit points in the long run. But maybe does 13 strength matter on? Maybe I can carry more stuff. All right, we'll do that. I do get to pick up a third level spell. Uh, it doesn't let me pick anything else. So I was thinking. This is always nice to have an extra one, but I've got Aramis doing that. Your serious wounds is nice, but I have cleric for that. Um, this slows down all my enemies. So rather than taking a summon monster, I think I'm going to take slow. That completes the bard. I don't need anyone's sympathy. And this is Ethos. He is my uh, alchemist. Let's keep him going up as a grenadier. He's got an extra plus on the poison resistance. He's going to get a discovery. <coughs> and that's going to be it. So. And then I found out that I really need to take Infusion because this means that anything, any spells that I'm using, like heals and stuff, I can use on other people. So I'm going to take Infusion. Get a point here. Uh, one thing that I have an odd number in is Wisdom, so I'm going to go ahead and make that an even one. It gives my will save a little bit. I have five points to use here. Definitely up on the Perception. Um, and the trickery. I'll use magic device and then these two things because why not? Okay, and then I get a spell. Now I get to choose a spell from anywhere. We have delay poison on Aramis. What I was looking for, oh, I only get to pick third level spells. I only get to pick third level spells. So I was, I'm torn. I have, oops, I've seen visibility in haste already. So it's a choice between resist energy, which Aramis has, and delay poison, which Aramis has. This would help against some of the arrow attacks we suffer. This, if we get down on sp on spells, I can just like rage everybody up. But heroism uh, strikes me as something that might be worthwhile because it's plus two on attack, rolls, saves, and skill checks for 10 minutes per level. And I really don't see, other than like a cure serious wounds, which I don't think I really need. Um, and I think I might be able to copy that spell off of a scroll, which I'm going to try and do. Oh, man, I just don't know. Haste and see invisibility are the really important ones. Hmm. 
resistance to ranged weapons. Well, that's ranged weapons. That's all ranged weapons, but not spells. This makes me harder to hit. Heroism? I have to memorize this spell, so... Cannot use spells. Uh, I already take that at single level. Yeah, this was a mistake here at second level. I shouldn't have taken this. I should have taken something more useful. Uh, it only lets me pick third level spells. I want to go back and pick another second level spell. Um, I'm not sure if I have a scroll of heroism. But I might be able to copy it. I don't think I have this, so I'll take that. Okay. And then that's it for him. Uh, and then my wizard... I'm just going to level up. Um, let's keep him going up as a wizard. Um, he gets this, which lets him teleport 30 feet as a move action. Um, this lets him, like, there's been monsters that have been, like, charging him and coming after him. So, like, kill the wizard type thing. So this lets him, like, teleport away from them and stay alive. He does get a point here. Taking this up from 7 to 8 is not going to be huge. Intelligence will be huge. Because that helps his knowledge in Arcania. Wisdom would help here and also on his will save, but he doesn't really need a will save. Khan would give him more hit points. He has 58 now. If he did this, he'd go up to 66. So I'm not sure if I want to go there or just raise up his intelligence and make him a ridiculous wizard. I think we go with his intelligence. And you see he gets nine points here. So it's like no brainers, two, three, four, five. Hello. Um go ahead and raise his trickery. Because why not? Uh and then Do that so his mobility is up a little bit. And then just up his magic device. Actually, let's forget the mobility. Let's just use magic device as best as we can. All right. Then I get spells. And here, the wizard is allowed to... Pick up all sorts of... What do I have? I have one of these. I have heist. I'm going to summon monster. Another sea invisibility communal might be helpful. Ah, stinking cloud is always a good one. So I'll take stinking cloud. Um, I just realized you can use stinking cloud, which is can mess up things with lower fortitudes. One round per level at last. And if I have a delay poison from the cleric on everybody, we won't be affected. Because it's a save basically versus poison. So that's a good thing. Um, lightning bolt sounds good, but I was looking at one up here. 
Oh, what the heck was it? This just sounds like such a cute thing to do, just make everybody big. But I like this because it says 1d6 points of energy damage per caster level. He's going to be 8. So that's 8d6, and its effect and energy type is dependent on the type of dragon. So I'm assuming when I pick it, I get to pick which type of dragon I'm going to do, which means I, if they're immune to fire and cold, let's say, I can go well acid, or they're immune to acid and I can go well fire. So that just seems like something that might be worthwhile to have rather than ice storm. Okay. I think that's it. Yeah, I'm done. I get four fourth level spells. We're going to have to do spell books. Um, enlarge person. We've got potions and things for that. I've been taking snowball for things. I thought I'd take another magic missile because hey, they seem to be important right now and then I get an extra spell here I don't have a lot of choices here I've got three summon monsters and a web I thought I'd take another burning arc because it's per caster level the damage I'm trying to take things that I can maximize my damage on two haste seems to be enough a fireball is always good I have a summon monster and I was going to take a stinking cloud that one. And in here, I was going to replace a couple of these with a couple of dragon's breaths. I get an extra one. Two dragon breaths. An ice storm is nice if I can cast it far enough away, because I can cast it at long range, and then it would slow down their approach on me, because it becomes difficult to rain. All right, so that's that. Um, is it him? No, he's just normal uses. This guy. Uh, Bard. He's got these things are combat spells, but they only last for so long. So I thought I'd take another one of those. So that ranges makes my range. Uh, my range is by ten feet, and I get a plus one to hit with them. I get two here. Um, I don't have a lot. I'm going to get rid of this protection from arrows. I'm going to have. I'm going to take a couple fields, and then I think I'm going to take three of each because I just don't have decent spells at second level. I picked the wrong thing. See, invisibility communal and a haste. I, protection from arrows communal seems like a good idea for now because we've been running into archers. And he's got to memorize spells. Three blesses, two of this, and a shield of faith because that's what he has. Fairy fire might be interesting. We had that one guy that turned invisible. And if I can cast fairy fire in a five foot. Blur, displacement, invisibility, or other things. So rather than shield of faith, I thought I'd take fairy fire because I've been running into invisible stuff and that kind of bothers me. I do have two removed for yours and two blesses. Uh, two. Uh, protection from alignments. Summon monster. This is a C invisibility for myself. Bless weapon. Sounds like it might be a better thing because we have a C invisibility thing. And then this just does damage. So I thought I'd take that. Um, prayer. Searing light, of course. Um, it's going to take another delay poison to go along with that. And then over here, I've got one protection. What's this? Divine power, which is something for me. I don't know if I want to take divine power or shield. Strikes you with a melee attack, does normal damage. This is one round per level. This is one round per level. So these are combat spells. Um, as much as I'd love to take a monster summoning four, I think I'm going to need protection from energy. More. Plus one on attack rolls, damage rolls, strength checks, and strength plus skill checks for every three levels. So I'd be like plus two. This does 1d6 plus eight. Well, uh, this is kind of like 
you hit me, I do damage to you. So I'm going to be in a really wild thing. All right, so there we are. Everybody's got their spells memorized. Um, now we are moving it heavy. What's my time? I'm at 25 minutes. So what I think I'm going to do is I'm going to do a quick rest here on camera. Make sure that we get through it. Um, and then I'm going to uh, drop. I can rest there. And then I will go off camera, drop a bunch of this stuff so you guys don't have to watch me go click, 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 click. Um, we're going to try and see if we can make Tavi. And we're going to go ahead and rest right now. See if we get attacked by something. We got a we got a taffy, which gives us something. I don't remember what it is. What's taffy do for us? For 15 hours, we get a plus three bonus on our will saves, so that could be important. All right. So uh, put this up here to keep my timer from running out on me. Uh, if you like to see it, the thumbs up button. If you like to see it, go ahead and hit the subscribe button and hit the notify bell. You'll be notified when I upload videos. Uh, this was a bit of a boring session here, but we did love ourselves up. We're all a bunch of 8th levels now. Um, hopefully we've got a decent combination of spells to do something going forward. And, um, yeah, what's that? My dragon breath's up there. My stinking cough. Must be that one. All right. Um, until we meet again, stay safe and bye-bye.